Hey, welcome or welcome back to my channel. I'm Cami, and this is Cami's Closet. If you're new to my channel, thank you so much for tuning in. If you like content about handbags, luxury, contemporary style, jewelry, whatever you might find in a closet, if you like that kind of stuff, then stick around and please subscribe below. Hit the subscribe button, it's free, and it'll help my channel grow. If you come back, watch videos, you'll know when they are being uploaded. Um, so yeah, if you're not in my channel, thank you for coming back. I'm doing this video, uh, what, what's today? Today is Wednesday, actually. I started doing videos during the week because I'm really tired and on the weekends I want to go back to sleep after I take care of my dog. If you're new to my channel, I have a little puppy, well she's not a puppy, she's an older dog who just recently was diagnosed with diabetes and had her eyes removed. I'm not going to go into the whole thing, but we have to get up 5 a.m. to give her her insulin shots. She does not sleep through the night. We have to carry her to her wee wee pad. So for me to film like after work and then upload them on the weekends is easier than me getting up or when I get up at five in the morning on a Saturday or Sunday, both actually, I can go back to sleep and not film, worry about filming in the morning. So um, anyway, I have an unboxing. So I just wanna tell you that, you know, I guess you get what you pay for. This came, it's a, came in this bag. It's from TJ Maxx. The bag is filthy and the box came like this, broken and crushed. Isn't that nice? Isn't that nice? A luxury, well, okay, we're not gonna say luxury. To me, it's luxury. A contemporary, expensive handbag. Expensive handbag. And this is the kind of box they send it in. So, you know, God knows what it's gonna look like inside. Uh, but I will tell you, you can get some really great, great deals on TJ Maxx. I have this bag that's in this box already, and I got it from TJ Maxx several months ago in orange. And when I saw it in this color, I was like, that's really nice. Same price as the orange one. I was watching it for like a month, and I was telling Dawn from Dawn Loves Couture, I'm like, I really like this color. This is a beautiful color. But I wasn't that... I just didn't want to spend the 550. I just thought it would, you know, even though that was almost half price because the bag is 810, still available, I didn't want to spend the 550. So, of course, about a week ago, I go on TJ Maxx and what happens? I see the bag reduced another $110. So now I'm like, okay, this is an $810 bag. They're still available on the boutique website and in department stores. How could I not? I know, how could I not? I just shouldn't have, but I did. So here we go. Let me show you what I got. And uh, if you've been following me, you will know once you see this, what other bag I have, because I only have one in this brand, and now this will be two if I keep it and it's not destroyed. You saw the box it came in for crying out loud. Okay. We know what that is. And let's see. I don't know what this purple thing means on TJ Maxx. Does that mean it was a return and then it's being sent back or something? I don't know. Does anyone know what a purple tag on your item means? I don't even know. It just says it's oh it's requ it's required for the return. Do not take it off. Okay. In any case, are you ready to see this? It's it's very cute. It wow. It looks a little darker than it does. You know what? They always look darker on the website because they're on the website. I mean, they look darker in person on the website. They always have a thousand lights and cameras on them when they take pictures to upload. So let's see, are we ready? This is the Long Chomp Small Mailbox in what's supposed to be brown. In the mixed um, suede and leather. I love this is so cute. 
I love suede. It's not the best, it's not the most durable, but especially when it's brown suede. Brown suede is so rich looking. I'm gonna have to put my glasses on because I have to inspect it. So let me get my glasses on. Looks like it's in perfect condition, which it should be. I mean, this isn't a pre-owned bag. This is a brand new bag. It's just discounted because it's at TJ Maxx. Let me show you this. This is the sides. It is brown. It's a very dark brown. The back. The front has this really cute pocket. Doesn't fit much, but not like a phone. You could probably fit a card in here. It's definitely big enough for a card or maybe a key, you know, key fob with your keys on it, a couple of keys, maybe not a huge. This is the bottom. They don't put feet, I'm not sure why. Zip top. I'm not gonna take the plastic off the handles until I really thoroughly inspect it. It does have a crossbody, which is, if I remember correctly, it is not adjustable, the crossbody. So that could be a problem. I believe it's a good length for me, so it might be a problem for someone who's really, really tall or much broader than me. I'm five foot one and I'm small framed. So if this fits me, which it should be the same size as the orange one, then it might be, you know, too short for someone else. It has, um, I don't remember this, in the, if the orange one has this key holder on the inside, it probably does. I haven't used it in a long time. You know something, this is definitely not a spring or summer bag. This would be a fall winter bag. And that's probably why, well, maybe not, I don't know. You know, TJ Maxx is all over the country, so it's not just because summer is coming that they reduce this. Um, but I figured I wanted it, but it wasn't that, you know, that important. But when it dropped down another $110, I said, I definitely want to have this bag for next fall. I love brown. And I only have one dark brown small bag. And that's my YSL bag in the all leather, the small, um, which you've seen me use because it's one of my most used bags. So this, this is absolutely beautiful. It really, it really is beautiful. I'm going to attach this and do a quick mod shot. The rings are on the outside of the bag. The D rings are on the outside that holds the strap. I did mention on the orange one that they're across instead of on on you know either side here. They're diagonally across, but that doesn't really bother me. Look how pretty these are! Very pretty, and they do swivel, which is very important. We know, so your bag. Um, strap doesn't get all twisted up. So yeah, um, again, it's, uh, uh, you know, detachable, but not adjustable, and it's not very long. I'm going to throw it on. Look how pretty the, uh, the zipper pull is. It says long chomp on there. It has the uh, signature horse, right? That's a horse. Yeah, I guess it's a horse. A horse. It says long chomp right here. It's a beautiful, beautiful brown. So, the handles are definitely, obviously, you could hold them in your hand. And they look like they're about three to four inches in um, drop. So, it goes right over my arm. Um, if you have very, very large forearms, it might not work for you. But it'll definitely go on the wrist, you know, if you need to throw it on your wrist just so you could be hands-free. So, let me show you real quick. Very cute. This is in the crook of the arm. Obviously, you won't be able to see down there if I'm holding it in my hand. If I hold it in my hand and drop my hand, my arm, the strap doesn't go near the floor. And I'm 5'1", so that's, you know, I'm close to the floor. So, um, so that, it's because the strap isn't very long. Let me throw the strap on right now.
I'm going to say that the strap drop from the top of the bag to here is probably 21. Most, on the average, the shortest strap um, drops, crossbody strap drops, are around 21. And then they kind of fluctuate between like maybe 21 and 25 inches or 21 and 24 inches, maybe 20 inches and and 25 inches, somewhere around there. Generally, when they make a strap that's not adjustable, it's somewhere between 21 and maybe 22 and a half. I'm not sure why they do that. It should always be adjustable. They should never ever have a strap that's not adjustable. People are adjustable. We're all different heights. We're all different sizes. We need adjustable straps. But this happens to work for me. So I'm gonna say it's about 21, maybe 21 and a half. It's very cute. I saw it a while back and I did not add to cart. I didn't. Um, Cause I said, you know, it's, it's definitely a fall or winter bag, especially that it has suede. I, I'm not using it for another, whatever, six months, five months. Um, but you know, it was a good price and I couldn't find it anywhere else. The cheapest price is TJ Maxx. They have the orange one. If you're interested, it's called marmalade but some places call it red i don't know why it's completely 100 percent unmistakably orange they have it on nordstrom rack right now for 460 i think in the orange in this size the small so if you're interested go to nordstrom rack they have so many long chomp on sale right now tons on nordstrom rack um, they don't have this one in brown. They only have it in orange on Nordstrom Rack. But they had it in TJ Maxx and for less than Nordstrom Rack because they dropped it, like I said, another $110. So it was $440. It's, a, it's an $810 bag. And it's, it's gorgeous. It's brown. It's beautiful. Again, I know suede could be a little bit, you know, risky. But it's just on the sides. The bottom has the leather, the, the pebbled leather. Well, not pebbled. I don't know what that is. It's such a beautiful color brown, like a deep, deep, deep chocolate brown. Um, what's inside? It does have... Um, what does it have inside? It does. It has a zipper compartment on the back wall here. It's hard to see. It's so dark. But it does have a zipper compartment. It has a, the, the card. Oh, and on the other side, it's a slip pocket. I know you can't see it, but my whole hand is in the slip pocket. Um, it's a, identical to the orange one that I got. So if you want to check back at that video and see the orange one, you can find it. <laughs> anyway, so it, this is just, this is adorable. I, I love the size. I love the style. I personally think this style is way nicer than the Le Pliage, you know, the, the, the very common one that's, what is it, a half moon or whatever with the little, the little wings on the side. It's a very cute bag. I do. I love it. But I think these are nicer. I just, I like them. They're a little bit bigger, um, you know, which I guess is good. It depends on what you're looking for. But I just, I just love these. So these are the only two long chomps that I have. Again, if I'm keeping this, which I don't see why I wouldn't be, but of course, after I stop filming, I inspect it thoroughly and make sure that there's nothing wrong with it, especially that it came, the, the box was a disaster. Um, I might call TJ Maxx and, you know, ask for a little bit of a discount back. This happened once before. I called them. I said, you sent me a, I had pictures. I wasn't kidding. I said, you sent me a box that was crushed. The bag inside was mushed up. I kept it because I was able to straighten it out. And they were like, oh, we're, we're so sorry. We're terribly sorry. We're going to send you a hundred dollars back. I was like, okay. <laughs> um, you see that box? It's ripped open. Um, the bag was in here, right? So it wasn't, well, it wasn't this, so it was weatherproof. Um, but, I, you know, I, I don't know. You, 
you're not talking about $15 items. This is an expensive item. You don't put it in a box that looks all crushed. And I can't believe that bo that box wasn't already like that. I can understand if it got dented in transit or a little bit crushed, but torn open through the bag. I don't think so. You know what? I'll tell you. This was the actual long chomp box because it says it right here. You know, like they like the the actual long chomp where it's you know this is the box that they probably got it in, so they were gonna send it. But I mean, it's torn here, it's ripped here, it has a hole in here. I mean, how do you send that again? This is a this is an eight hundred dollar bag. Maybe I didn't pay $800, but it's an $800 bag. That's what you send it in? In any case, it looks to be in absolutely pristine, perfect condition, not any damage to it, nothing. It's absolutely beautiful. If you like dark brown, you, again, you might not be seeing it like that. You might be seeing it more like black, but it is a dark chocolate brown. A little bit hard to tell but it is it's a beautiful color so anyway you'll be seeing this video on Sunday so have a great week and I hope you caught the collab between me and my YouTube friends Dawn from Dawn Loves Couture Winnie from Winnie BLV Yoda from Yoda Style we did a collab that was last Wednesday evening so if you did not catch that collab go check it out it's a lot of fun we did a competition amongst the uh four of us so go check it out if you didn't see it anyway have a great day and i will see you next week <music>